What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to some breaking news, and we have some massive outs from the Monte Carlo Open. Some big upsets overnight, including the world number one. Let's go see who else is lost. All right, so we started with 16 seeds at the start of the week. Now we have some big outs, starting with the 16th seed, Garen. He lost to City Pass in the third round. 14th seed, Dimitrov lost to Nadal in the third round. 13th seed, Hercatch, second round loss to Evans. 12th seed, Karina Busta also lost in the third round. 10th seed, Gail Monfils pulled out before the tournament started. The number nine seed, Batista Agu, he lost in the third round to Rublev. The eighth seed, Berrettini, he's out in the second round round. Schwartzman, number seven seed, also out in the second round. Alexander Zverev, the number five seed, he got upset by David Goffin in the third round. The number two seed, Daniel Medvedev, he withdrew before the tournament started. And the biggest upset of the year, not only the tournament, but the year, Novak Djokovic lost in the third round to Dan Evans in straight sets. So some massive names have fallen overnight, including the number one in the world, Novak Djokovic. He was on a 10-match win streak in 2021, first loss of the year and he loses the unseeded Evans. But even though we have some of the big seeds falling out, we do still have Nadal, we still have Tsitsipas and Rublev. So some big names are still in there, but in the quarterfinal stage, we're missing a lot of those big names. Like I said, including Djokovic, who is probably the biggest upset of the year. Let me know down in the comments below. Is that the biggest shock for you? Or do you think someone else is a little bit more shocking? Do you think maybe Zverev losing to Goffin is a little bit more of a shock? For me, Djokovic, hands down, biggest upset of the year. Not just this tournament, but for the year. We're starting to get into the business end of Monte Carlo, and the seeds are starting to fall. 